Hello, this is Dr. Earl. I'm excited to continue our discussion about our gut reset program. This video is our welcome to testing and discovery. We thank you for your trust. We genuinely do. It's the efforts of yourselves and a lot of people behind the scenes that really make this possible. Again, thank you. So much better than doing nothing or Western medicine where it can be managed or soft and almost sort of their programs. We are in it to win it. We're hopeful, even expectant, that you're going to do well and get the results that you desire. Our comparison sheet shows why we're so expectant and hopeful that you'll do well. We address all of the major issues in regards to sick gut and are excited to have you on board. Now, many of you have seen this before. This is the inside of one of our trifolds. It's called our plan and path. This is where we lay out what to expect and where we will be headed with your care. The first piece of this is discovery. So we need to discover what's truly going on. By the time you start to have symptoms consistent with sick gut, chances are most of the compensatory or compensation mechanisms inside of your body have, have become compromised. And that means that we need to start addressing this as a system, not individual symptoms, but as a system as a whole. We find the patients get better faster, they do better, etc. Well, a big piece of that is making sure we know everything that's going on. And we have three major components that really help us discover what's going on inside of your body. The first is an intake form. This is a detailed history. Yes, it is lengthy. We know that. That said, we're aware that an intake form really can be our greatest tool in discovering things that other tests may not. What we find is that each of these tests, intake, blood, urine, stool, and AO scan, each have about a 75 to 85% specificity rate. This means that in order to really hone in on your disease, we need to compile tests so that we can be as close to 100% as we can be. That's why our discovery is so important. Now, before we start talking about specifics, I want to cover some other items that are on this trifold. First, think win-win. There are going to be some difficult times. Any time that someone says, I can get you well, and we're going to make it just a bed of roses, run. Because getting from illness to wellness often requires some discomfort. That's just the reality. That's the reality of our bodies. That's the reality of getting rid of fungus and parasites. That's the reality of reconstructing our bodies in a healthy and vibrant way. But you need to think win-win and be ready for those difficult times. Get past them. Look beyond them and make sure that you're willing and ready to, to take those steps. It is so critical that we don't expect perfection, especially not immediately. The truth of the matter is that this is complicated. There's a lot to this. We understand that. We know there'll be times that will be hard. We know there'll be times that are difficult to get past. There'll be a lot of challenges, be that illness or not feeling well or medication, supplements not hitting right. All of those things just take time. Please be patient. Don't expect perfection. Keep moving forward. Biggest thing you can do. The other thing of note is the fact that it may take several rounds to completely heal the gut. The Gut Institute plans on their patients being with them for three years or more. The key difference is they charge every six months. We do not. However, that doesn't mean that this is a quick fix. It's not. We're looking to completely heal your gut, and that means it's going to take time, effort, dedication, etc. There are six month or 12 month repeating programs. There are three programs available, a gold program, a silver program, and a simple amazing program. The gold program is a six month repeating program. It's aggressive it's for patients who want to get better as quickly as possible. Then there's the 12 month program. This tends to come at a little lower cost, fewer supplements to take, but it does take longer to get well. Then there's the simple amazing program. This program is for very specific subsets of patients. And if you're chosen for that program, it's because you meet those parameters. Let's look at a few of the checklists in order to optimize your health. Nutritional IVs are amazing. Our IVs are optimized, balanced on an osmolar level. This means that they don't irritate your veins. They're ready to go to work right away and delivering vitamins, nutrients, and minerals right into your cells. They can help you detox. We also provide a neural reset. This focuses on the vagus nerve, which connects everything from your lower pelvis all the way up through your throat, your nose, and beyond. It's critical in the function of normal, healthy gut. We'll also talk about pulse electrical magnetic field. These are devices that you can rent or purchase for use at home that balance your body energetically and provide increased energetic boosts for recovery. We strongly hope you'll consider getting a cone CT scan. This scan of the jaw and face helps us discover pockets of infection or other abnormalities that would otherwise hide and have a significant detrimental effect on your health. Also, we strongly recommend an Atlanto occipital adjustment. This is the connection between the first cervical vertebrae or the first bone in your neck and the bottom of the skull. And we find that 80 to 85% of 
patients are misaligned in this area. Realigning this area allows for proper neural function and energetic connection throughout the body. Okay, let's do a deeper dive into our intake form, blood, urine, and stool testing, and AO scan. First, our intake form. Our intake form is very detailed. We understand that a detailed history is critical as far as discovery. We want to be sure we discover all of the sparks and triggers of disease. And that means that we ask a lot of questions. Body types, congenital illnesses, pain assessments. And then we go system by system and complaint by complaint and ask a series of questions in order to get at the core of what's really going on. You're going to find that many of these questions are redundant. Systems overlap. That's the reality of the human body. And in order for us to get an adequate picture or a full description of what's going on, we question about these overlaps in different settings to make sure we've discovered the true nature of the illness. Next is our blood, urine, and stool testing. Shortly after your initial visit, you'll receive your lab testing. This will come in the form of an email. It will look a lot like this. And all you need to do is simply sign in and then download your requisition. Let me show you how that's going to occur. So first, click on the pink button. That should take you to a page that looks similar to this where you'll be requested to log in, access your patient and or start your patient account, and then activate your labs by paying for them. On this page, they request a username and password. Create a username and password with a system, something you'll remember, or write it down somewhere safe. Then you'll be taken to a page similar to this, where you'll have the opportunity to activate your orders. After you pay for those tests, this page should show up. If it doesn't, click on the order page here and you'll see where you're able to download your labs. Downloading your labs will then bring you to a page or a PDF similar to this. You can pull that up in your download folder or on your desktop wherever you have your files downloaded. This page will list identifying information at first and the tests that you're going to receive. Now understand that these are your blood and urine tests. They do not include some of the other testing. Those will come later. On the last page of this sheet will be your instructions. Please read these very carefully. You're going to need to find a lab corp. You're going to need to take this sheet to them. They will have all the information they need on this sheet. You do not need to take proof of insurance. You should not have to make any payments. If you have any questions, please feel free to call this number, 888-852-2723. Optimally, you should be fasting for eight hours prior to taking this test. Drinking water is okay. A few days later, after activating your labs, you're going to receive several kits. There may be one kit, there may be three. It depends upon what test you've ordered. And each of these tests are very different. There's the organics test, there's the organic metabolites, and there's the mycotoxin panel. The organics test instructions are fairly simple. Please make sure you have a good understanding of the test and how to ship it in, how to fill out the forms, etc. If you have any questions, please feel free to call Avexia at any time. The next test is the organic acid metabolites test. Again, very detailed instructions, when to collect your urine, how to fill out the forms, etc. is all included. Please follow the instructions to the letter. If you have any questions, reach out to Avexia or Denali. And lastly, we'll discuss the mycotoxin panel. They're going to be asking for your demo demographic information. This test has already been selected. No reason to select anything else. They'll walk you through how to collect the urine, how to send it in, and where to send the specimen. Again, if you have any questions, please feel free to call Avexia. Next on our list of discovery is the AO scan. Now I mentioned the AO scan in particular because that's the software we're using now. However, understand I'm constantly looking for new and improved and better diagnostic tools that can help us really truly discover what's going on inside your body. Also, these can be very predictive. Sometimes they can predict issues that are going on well before we actually see them from a symptom standpoint. And the reason is because we're actually measuring energy in your body. And energy is often the first shift that happens between wellness and illness. And so this can be very predictive. And mentioned there are other scanners out there. This is the this is an example of the Zyto scan, a great scanner, but uh, it's not as efficient currently as the AO scanner. A lot of this is based off the work from Nikola Tesla. He realized that everything has to do with energy, frequency, vibration, and resonance. And the AO scan and energy scans or bioelectrical feedback scans are no different. We think that the universe is solid matter, and the reality is it is not. The truth of the matter lies. In 
in the fact that the atom is almost 100% empty space, but it really comes down to maybe 2% that's actually solid matter. If you consider the electron and the nu nucleus, the neutrons and protons, solid matter, which again, there's debate about that as well. But if you really consider those as the solid pieces, the rest is, is empty space or even better put energy or energy clouds. And so most of our human bodies, much of what we consider solid matter is actually energy. 2% might be actually solid. Again, that's debatable. The way that biofeedback energy detection work or discovery works is by bouncing energy off atoms. And we found that if we bounce energy off atoms, each one gives a unique and particular resonance or output. And we can measure that. Well, come to find out that is true for atoms, it's true for elements, and it's also true for molecules. Even as complex as we are as human beings, we give off our own unique set of vibration, resonance, and energy, and that can be measured. So again, we bounce an energy sequence off the individual atoms. The atom gets excited, and then it will declare itself by de-excitation, and that energy output we're able to measure. People ask, okay, well, if this is so great, why aren't we using this in Western medicine? Well, we are, because the reality is your EKG, the EKG that you receive from the cardiologist or the emergency department is us measuring energies, uh, vibrations, frequencies, etc., from your heart that is transferred throughout your entire body. The heart is the most powerful electromagnetic engine in the body, and we use that to measure your health. And so, yes, we are using it as a measurement tool now. We just aren't using it to the extent that it can be used. And if we go further, magnetic resonance imaging, resonance is right in the word, uh, MRI. We use MRIs to get diagnostic imagery of what's going on deep inside of your body, and we do that through bouncing radio waves off the particular molecules that are inside of your body. And the resonance, the, the reflection, is what we measure, and that is very unique for each molecule. So we are using it in medicine, just not to the extent that it, it, it can be. And that is how the AO scanner works. We place these small headphones on your head. It bounces energy throughout your entire body and then reads it very, very quickly. This particular scanner can read over 120,000 different frequencies, molecules, different entities inside of your body. Absolutely amazing. If you've acted both your lab testing and treatments, the next video should be in your email. If you're testing only, schedule an appointment with Denali at least two weeks after you send in your last testing. If you have any questions, first review this video, second, call Avexia, and third, please feel free to call Denali. Thank you.